Let's say you view this card reader for iPhone and iPad. This is the box, this is how it looks. It's called Lightning to SD card camera reader. And with this device, you can import everything from this card to your phone gallery, or you can export everything from your phone to this SD card. And when I say you can import and export everything, I mean not only the photos here in gallery, but also every other file that is available uh, on your phone or on your card. And why not on iCloud? Immediately I will show you. This is the box lightning to SD card camera reader. This is how it looks. Very careful. There are a lot of fakes on the market. So uh, be careful what you get. Inside of the box you will get uh, these, uh, these papers related to this device and of course the adapter. So this is how it looks. It's well built i like the quality it's solid i like here um, the wire also very solid and um, well made how you uh, how do you use this and uh, what you can do with it first of all you can use micro sd cards either in this format or uh, with the adapter i mean or you can use sd cards this uh, huge format anyway with micro SD card, you will, you will need this adapter. You insert it here. In this way, you have this icon here. You cannot insert it like this. So like this. And after that, you insert the adapter here in your iPhone or iPad. Uh, you will see in the gallery after that, uh, this, uh, this new icon here in port. And if you press on it, you will see all the photos that are on the on this card so if you if you take if you took some photos with a, with another camera let's say and you insert the card here you will have a new button called import and if you press on it you can uh, you can see all the photos on the card there is one condition the photos have to be in that photo folder or um, uh, DCIM folder how it's called and after that you will see them here if no photo is available on your iPhone here in import uh, uh, new button import here if you don't see any photo but still you have photos on the card it seems in that moment you will need to use uh, file explorer basically I have here photo gallery and uh, the app files you will have to use your file explorer and here you will see your card and you have access to the entire content you can copy everything and uh, you can do almost everything you want just like on a on a pc on your laptop in your sd in your card reader so this has huge advantages let's go back to to gallery and for example, I have these photos. You have two options, the, uh, as I said, the first way. Either you use your gallery to import photos from card to iPhone, or you can use files uh, to import everything from your, uh, from your card, uh, photos, videos, and so on, and other files. Or here in the gallery, for example, if you want to export your photos, let's say that I want to export um the these photos i select them press share button and here just scroll and press save uh, press save to file sorry here press save to files this is it and in this moment you you have access to that file explorer select card and you can put them in uh, in any folder you want or you can create a new folder it depends on your press save and that's it now these photos were exported to this sd card uh, to check that go to um, to file explorer select card here and here in download look you will find your photos or videos or text documents whatever you you want to 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 move copy and so on for, because here in file 
if you press like this, you have an entire uh, uh, suite of options. So in this moment, let's say that you have on this card photos in this folder here in download, for example, and you want to put these photos in your iPhone gallery, just select, select them or as many as you want, press share button and press here, save three images. They will be saved in your phone's gallery or iPad gallery. If you have an iPad with lightning, um, my iPad Pro has USB Type-C and I can use in that case an adapter like this and I can use any stick, card reader, external hard drive. It's convenient to have the USB Type-C over there. Anyway, that's another discussion. So this is it, a very convenient way to to use um, to use your uh, phone, iPad, to import, export photos or any other file. This is it. Very simple, in my opinion, and very useful. And it works flawlessly. I don't have any problem with it. It's fast, and um, I can do anything as long as I want to uh, uh, to import, export files. Uh, from iPhone to card to SD card or to, from SD card to iPhone. This is it.